Hello, my name is Sweetie from Trenton, and today I would like to speak to you and show you all about the Groomix Power Bathing Pump System. This system is one of my favorite systems to wash dogs. You don't have to use a lot of shampoo, water, and energy. So you save a lot of time, you use less shampoo, and it's a fantastic system, and it really washes the dogs very nicely. This system is actually a circulation system. It's a bath pump. It consists of a submergible pump, a flexible hose, a spray nozzle that can be regulated. The system is switched on and off with an air pressure button. This button can be mounted on the floor or on the wall. You place, first of all, the pump in the bath. Then you put the stopper in the drain of the bath. So you fill the bath with a layer of water, about a finger high, and then you add the shampoo to the water. The shampoo can be a small bottle cap shampoo. Connection to the water supply is not necessary. The water and the shampoo are circulated with the pump system and the water is forced through the coat until the dog is clean. Generally, this takes five minutes. If the dog is very dirty, you can fill the bath again with new clean water and shampoo and repeat the pump's process. After, you just need to rinse the dog with clean water. How do we clean the dog with the circulating the dirty water? Soap and cleaning agents have the capacity to retain the dirt and oil. In the same way we do with dishwashers and our clothing washing machines. The pump is also a fantastic way to use your conditioners. You can fill the bath with a layer of water and add a conditioner to dilute. The same way the conditioner will be ejected to the hair and the coat and the skin. After, you don't need to rinse. When not to use. Most medical shampoos should not be diluted to achieve the correct therapeutic effect. The instructions on the label should be followed. However, you can still rinse the shampoo with the pump system. Maintenance. Some hair can collect on the bottom of the bath pump. As soon as the pump is switched off, this hair forms a lump at the bottom. After you've drained the bath, lift up the pump and scoop the hair out and throw it away. This prevents the hair from clogging in the drain. In addition to removing the hair between washes, you can occasionally fill the bath with water and add a cup of vinegar to it. If you circulate this mixture through the pump, you can remove any remaining shampoo residues. Advantages. Number one, efficiency. One step fix instead of three to four different steps. Number two, using less shampoo because of the pump system. Number three, using less water because of the pump system. Four, saves you time. Number five, no sudden temperature changes. Water doesn't come from the faucet. Number six, less chance of irritation of allergic reactions because of the shampoo is more diluted. Number seven, rubbing less is actually also much better for the hair. Rubbing has risk of breakage. You can have knots or you can damage the hair. Number eight, giving your hands a rest. Number nine, good for the environment, using less water and shampoo. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to write them below. And you can always subscribe to our Transgroom TV channel. Thank you very much. Bye.